Hi there everyone. Welcome to Fingers Fums and Fits, and in this episode of Titty Piddle I will be painting one of the Dungeon Saga Origins Kickstarter exclusive heroes, the human monk Hadras of Wolfmarch. Can I keep the paint inside the lines? Let's find out. This is another model that drew its inspiration from a video game. Whenever I think of a fighting monk, I think of the monk from Final Fantasy, and so I was hoping to pay homage to that. So, I started with a base of Korax White. The tunic got a layer of frost heart. And although the Final Fantasy monk has tan skin, I went for a darker tone as I was going to use a tan color for the leather details. So I painted his head with rhinox hide. And speaking of leather, the gloves and boots got a coat of XV88. His head and trousers got a wash of Nuln oil, and the leather details got some snakebite leather. His face then got a subtle highlight of a 2 to 1 mix of Rhinox Hide and XV88. The Nuln oil did most of the heavy lifting here. I then re-layered the boots and gloves with XV88. As I did, I remembered his book and belt. So they got a layer of XV88 also, while the book's binding got a coat of Rhinox Hide. They were then both washed with snakebite leather. I then finished off by giving his beard a coat of Black Templar, and highlighting the boots and gloves with Rikarth flesh. And there we have a completed Hadras of Wolfmarch, painted as a homage to the monk from Final Fantasy. So, what do we think? Did I manage to keep the paint inside the lines? Please let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you again for the next one. Have a great day everyone, and I'll see you later.